All right, let's simplify this fraction here. We have 12 nineteenths, and we'd like to reduce this down to the lowest terms. So what we can do is we can find the factors of 12 here and then the factors of 19, and we'll find the greatest common factor. So we'll work from there. So for 12, there are a number of different factors. I'll just put them up here. You could have 1 times 12, that's 12. 2 times 6, that's 12. Or 3 times 4, that's 12 as well. But for 19, for 19, the only thing we've got is 1 times 19. That equals 19. But there aren't any other factors. So it looks like the greatest common factor, 19, that's not up here, 1 is. So 1 is the greatest common factor. So if you divide 12 by 1, you get 12. If you divide 19 by 1, you get 19. And you can see we're right back where we started, 12 nineteenths. That means that this fraction here, 12 nineteenths, it's already simplified. We can't reduce it any further. It's in lowest terms. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B simplifying 12 nineteenths, except it's already in lowest terms. Thanks for watching.